Hi friends, welcome to my channel Lotus Geek. In this tutorial, we're gonna fix an error we couldn't install Windows in the location you choose. Before proceeding, I request you to please click on the subscribe button to continue watching more such tech and how-to videos. Now let's go ahead and proceed with the resolution. The very first step or the basic step is to make sure you disconnect all other drives from your PC. For example, your external hard drive, your wireless mouse or wireless keyboard. I mean, if you have attached any other external device with your computer, please unplug those devices and then go ahead and try to install your Windows again. This really helps a lot of people. So make sure you do that. Now, if this doesn't work out, we are going to proceed to the second step. In second step, make sure you choose the installation or make the installation drive as per your bio setup for example while creating windows usb installation file in the partition scheme and in the target system make sure if you choose gpt as a partition scheme the target system must be a uefi and if you are choosing an mbr scheme then make sure the target system must be BIOS or in simple words if you have a computer older than 2015 or 2016 make sure you choose the partition scheme as an MBR and if you have the latest computer make sure to choose the partition scheme as an GPT if you do not have this tool I'll provide the link of this tool also in the description below so that you can download and make a new installation media using this Rufus tool. Once created the media, go ahead and install Windows using this software. Now go ahead and install Windows again. Choose the drive where you want to install Windows and then click on the next button to proceed. If still you face the problem over here, then we are going to proceed with the third step. In third step, we are going to recreate all your partitions. So make sure you backup your data. If there is any data in your system, that data will be completely erased. So now in third step, select your disk and click on delete button. Hit the OK button to delete the partition of your system. Once deleted, now choose the unallocated space and click on the new option now it has shown the space by default it is taking the maximum space available in your drive hit the apply button now the partition we have created once formatted and now again created a new disk part now again click on the next button to fix this issue if somehow still it is not resolved we are going to proceed to the fourth step. In fourth step, we are going to solve this issue using the disk part application. So again, go ahead and install Windows or give boot from your installation media. I'll go ahead and quit it and I'll go ahead and boot it from the installation media. Now here, instead of install now, click on the repair your computer. Now click on troubleshoot and click on command prompt. Now here you need to type few commands one by one. Type here disk part and hit the enter button. Now type again list disk and again hit the enter button. Now select the disk as select disk 0 because disk 0 is the available disk we have. Now once the disk is selected, now type here clean and hit the enter button. Now we have successfully cleaned the disk. Now go ahead and type exit and close the command prompt. Now go ahead and again restart and try to install your windows in your system. Now we are going to install the windows again in your system.
now the drive space is totally unallocated first create space for the windows installation hit the again okay button now once the space is created now go ahead and click on the next button this time your windows installation will be proceed successfully if somehow you still face any kind of issue kindly comment below and i'll provide you more ways for the resolution so that's it about it friends if you like my video i request you to please click on the subscribe button and share my channel with your friends also thank you friends thank you for watching